guys welcome back to my channel it's me afreen and i wish you all a very 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 happy new year and uh, 2017 has started so it's time to show you guys what were my favorites in the year 2016 it, in it includes all sort of beauty products hair care to skin care and also random stuff so yeah let's get into it so the first thing that i will show you guys is this girnar uh, green de uh, detox green tea it's a desi kawa and the special thing about is about this uh, green tea is that it does not taste like the usual green teas it tastes amazing it tastes like a mild chinese soup sort of which is why i truly love it and there are 36 tea bags in it it tastes amazing and i would highly recommend it please give it a try then the next stuff i'll come to is this hair mask which is from tony and guy nourish reconstruction mask this mask has really helped me or uh, repair my hair my hair was truly damaged because uh, i had once done perming to my hair and it had damaged my hair so badly that i i had to literally tie my hair and keep it all the time and that was the time when i came to know about this reconstruction mask and i've been using it since then it is my second tub and i still still adore it so yeah i would highly recommend this uh, nourishing hair mask as well and it is very affordable and you can easily find it so yeah this is also one of my most favorites in 2016 all right so the second product is this sephora lagoon moisturizing body lotion i got this because it looks so amazing i mean this is super cute and also the fragrance is i mean it smells heavenly and that's the reason i got it also the texture the consistency of this body lotion is so gentle on uh, your skin like it is not at all thick it is uh, very thin and it easily gets uh, absorbed into your skin and it also gives a nice dewy sort of finish and that's the reason i like it so yeah i used it throughout 2016 not only during winters but during summer during monsoon and i think i'm still going to continue it this year as well All right so the next product is this uh, face moisturizer by Neutrogena it's an oil free moisturizer and i've been using it since 2015 and i think i'm going to i'm going to continue it forever unless and until i find a better option and the best part about this is it is super light and because i have a combination skin i sometimes it gets too dry sometimes it gets oily and sometimes combination so for me i mean for my skin this is the most amazing product i can ever try so that's the reason this is uh, every year it's one of my favorites and i still am and i think i'm still going to continue it and uh, this is very affordable and easily available as well so yeah you should try it then the next product is uh, a face scrub and this is this one is from aroma magic a blossom pouch aroma magic and again it's a mineral glow scrub it is very gentle the granules are not at all uh, very hard like they are super sensitive like easily you can scrub it on your face and it's so gentle that you can also use it on daily basis but i would suggest you to use it like thrice or twice in a week and it does give you great results so This was also my 2016 favorite like I have used it a lot. Now the next one is a face mask again from Aroma Magic Blossom Coach. I have again I have reviewed it in my, in one of my blog posts and uh, since then like 2016 almost 6 to 7 months I've been using it and it is one of my most favorite face packs ever. It is uh, made of charcoal and charcoal is something that we all should give it a try because they are so good for your skin you can visibly get get great results and many of my friends also tried it and they also adore it so much and i think you should also give it a try it is just for rupees 495 and you get so much i mean you can use it for like more than 6 months which is a great deal and you should definitely give it a try and the next product is this uh, cleansing lotion by cetaphil I started using it in the year 2012 and since then I just love it. Like this is uh, one of those cleansing lotion uh, that are so gentle to your skin and it does not give you any sort of breakouts or allergy. So that's the reason I like it and it also removes your makeup super quickly. You don't have to struggle at all and the only thing is it smells a kind of weird after a while but otherwise formulation wise texture wise it is so good and you should definitely give it a try again this is so affordable it's just for rupees 179 which is a great deal and uh, this cleansing lotion is uh, so good like it, you can compare it with all high end cleansing lotions and that's the reason i truly adore it and i've been using it since so long and i think i'm going to continue it in uh, coming years as well 
Then the next product is this Moroccan oil, Argan Moroccan oil uh, from OGX. I've been using OGX products since really long and I have tried most of their products. Also, I adore their shampoos a lot, shampoos and conditioner. And uh, one fine day I came across this product which is a Moroccan oil. Moroccan oil is very essential for your hair and it does give you a lot of difference in your hair. I mean, when you use it, you will actually come to know the difference in your hair. and. Uh, this oil is super light i mean it is thick but uh, the way it works on your hair is truly amazing it softens it gives a nice shine and also it helped me in preventing split ends so that's the reason i would truly uh, recommend it and you won't believe but i've been using it from past eight months and it is still like half filled so yeah it's a great deal and you should definitely give it a try the next product is this himalaya uh, baby care wipes and i've been using it from past four to five months and I truly love them. Before this I used to use Johnson Baby's wipes but then when I came across this one I found it better than that because again it is very gentle and it does have a very uh, you know mild sort of scent which is good because uh, I personally don't like uh, products that has really sweet sort of fragrance and this one is just perfect and also affordable. I got it for uh, like I got I got it for 150 rupees and it has 80 wipes yeah no it has 72 wipes and it is super affordable and that's the reason I like it so you can definitely give it a try and now it's my favorite part of this video and I'll start with the beauty products so I can never forget to mention this product I think every year because this is one of my most 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 favorites and uh, as you guys know I am not a foundation person instead of foundation I prefer BB and CC cream I have tried a lot of BB creams but you know every time I come back to this BB cream only because it is so good like uh, if you're looking for a medium coverage which is very light on your skin and it does give you a nice even uh, toned skin and also it is very affordable easily blendable and and I just love it so I think this is going to be my favorite forever this I find a better one so yeah I would highly recommend this as well then the next product is this eye cream I have uh, uh, I recently got it uh, VLCC had sent me and uh, I've been using it from almost two months and I'm getting such great results that I just thought I'll include it as well in this video and the best part about it is it does not have any any sort of fragrance and it does gives a nice cooling sort of sensation near uh, my eye area and that's the reason I love it. It is again very affordable, blendable, the consistency texture is so good. And the next product is this concealer uh, by Maybelline. It's a Fit Me uh, concealer which is in the shade 20 Sand Sable. And uh, yeah, I've been using it from past 7-8 months and I truly like it. The best part about it is it really matches my skin tone and it is super blendable. It is quite affordable and uh, yeah that's the reason I like it so I've been using it a lot so I thought of including this as well this product uh, I'll come to is this uh, Revlon highlighter I also adore my makeup revolutions illuminate pro but uh, after that if I like some something else then it has to be this one it is Revlon bronze glow 030 highlighter and I can use it for multi-purpose for my uh, eyeshadow as an eyeshadow as a blush highlighter for contouring and yeah that's the reason i truly like it next is this uh, shambor stay on waterproof eyeliner pencil again i have included this in one of my first videos uh, and uh, i've been using it from past three years and i still still like it so much that i just can't try something else yes i do uh, have other eyeliners as well but this is one of my most favorites and this is again very very affordable highly pigmented and it stays on for really really long so again i would highly recommend this eyeliner pencil as well i'll move on to lipsticks i i do adore a lot of lipsticks and uh, because i didn't want to make this video really long so i have chosen some of my most most favorites that i have really used a lot in 2016 so yeah let's get into it first i'll start with these two lipsticks these are by rimmel kate moss lipsticks and, and one is this nice berry shade which is 107 
I have I've been wearing it a lot during entire fall season. This is one of my most favorite uh, fall lipstick. This color is so so good. It complements my skin a lot. This is not typically matte lipstick, but it is uh, satin matte and it's very hydrating. That's the reason I just like it. The next one is also from the same uh, range, but it's pinky nude sort of lipstick, and I have. Almost used it as you can see and uh, the lipstick worked well to me and I wore it almost every single day and I still still like it. I'm definitely gonna restock it if ever I'm running out of it. So yeah, these two were my most favorites. Uh, then I am more into dark lipsticks so I have already uh, shown this lipstick to you guys in my previous videos as well. It's uh, NYX uh, Transylvania and this is one of my most favorites again. I truly like the packaging, the formula, the fragrance, everything is so good. The lasting power is also good. It is not at all drying. Patchiness is just not there when you apply this lip cream. So yeah, I would highly recommend this as well. Then on the next is uh, this uh, Chambord's Extreme Wear Transfer Proof Liquid Lipstick in the shade 436. This is also my most favorite. It's like a very, very beautiful dark burgundy sort of red and I just, just adore it. I wore it so much. I mean, a lot. I used to wear it every single uh, day and uh, everybody gave me a lot of compliments. Like people used to bombard me with questions which lipstick are you wearing from where did you get it and all so that's why i truly adored this as well then, then the next lip cream is uh, by Se is this one from sephora in the shade 03 it's a really nice bright pink with red undertones and i truly truly like it uh, it stays for really long and the formula is so good it does not dry my lips at all and lasts forever and lasts forever more than six to seven hours it does transfer a little but then but still it leaves a nice stain on the lips and that's the reason I truly adore this one as well. Next lipstick is this newly launched uh, by Lacme 9 to 5 in the shade Coffee Light. Again, I just love this lipstick a lot. This is my current favorite and I truly like the shade. I have already reviewed it in one of my videos as well. This is a nice mauve sort of shade which will suit a lot of skin tones and it is very uh, moisturizing to the lips, very hydrating, does not dry my lips at all and the best part about it is that I can use it for multi-purpose, I can use it as a blush and also lipstick so that's the reason I truly truly adore it and also it is very affordable. But then the next lipstick is this one by MAC in the shade Retro. It's a satin uh, matte finish and I truly like this lip shade a lot. Um, this is very hydrating again and uh, the best part about it is that it stays for really long and it is so lightweight I sometimes I don't even uh, feel like I have applied this lipstick and also the shade after applying looks amazing like uh, on the hand the swatches and all look very okay pretty okay but when you apply it on the lips and after some time the shade the way it settles it, it looks amazing and I totally love this one I wore it a lot at work then uh, the next lipstick is uh, I mean I have always mentioned it and this is my seventh tube in a row and I still still like it and it's just left this much I definitely have to buy it again and hopefully I just wish that it's not out of stock because this shade always runs out of stock it is so universally good and it suits almost every skin tone I'm talking about Lakme 9 to 5 in the shade Scarlet Drill I think Scarlet Drill is everybody's favorite and this lipstick has to be in this video because I've been using it from past three years and I still feel that this is one of the most beautiful shade I own and it is very very comfortable to wear it's super lightweight it stays for average decent uh, time and also very affordable and it looks really natural on your skin and I just love the rosy shade that it provides on my skin because it has a little bit of red undertones and mauve pinkish mixture it is so that's the reason I truly truly adore it and definitely I'm gonna restock it for my further years as well and the last one has to be this lip balm by Neutrogena I have used a lot of lip balms I have used the Sephora one was my uh, last favorite uh, but now it has changed to this one which is Neutrogena's, uh, Neutrogena's lip moisturizer which also has SPF 15 and 
I truly like this uh, moisturizer a lot. It is very affordable. It is so hydrating and it does not feel heavy on my lips. Just applying once during night time, it really leaves my uh, lips soft and supple throughout. I mean for the entire day and that's the reason I truly like it and this is very affordable so I think definitely you should give it a try I know you guys will love it so those were all my 2016 favorites there there were few more products which I wanted to include in this video but then I didn't want it to make it so long so yeah I have included products that uh, were my most most favorites and I have used them mostly in that year so yeah that's all so i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and once again i wish you all a very very happy new year till then i'll see you in my next video thank you so much for watching Bye -bye.